Welcome to our Connected Camps TeamSpeak setup video. TeamSpeak is the voice chat software we require for all of our programs. It makes communication fast and easy. In this video, we will show you how to set up TeamSpeak, connect to the Connected Camps voice server, and activate Push to Talk. We'll also introduce you to our server etiquette rules and guidelines. Let's jump right in. Downloading TeamSpeak is pretty easy. All you have to do is head over to teamspeak.com and click on the big green free download button. Then click on the download now button in the center of your screen. Follow the instructions provided in the setup wizard. The installer may suggest optional programs for you to install. Feel free to opt out by unchecking the box before moving on. Follow the instructions provided in the setup wizard. Drag the TeamSpeak icon to your Applications folder. Once you have TeamSpeak installed, launch the application. Once the application is open, look for the Connections tab in the top left corner. And in the drop-down menu, click Connect. Enter the server address, and underneath it, enter your Minecraft username. Last but not least, you enter the server password. This will be emailed to you whenever you sign up for camps or labs, so it's okay if you don't know it right now. Click Connect, and now you're in the Connected Camps TeamSpeak server. Next, we need to set up Push to Talk, and here's why it's important. With Push to Talk, Hello, everybody. Are you ready for another day at camp? without Push to Talk. Without Push to Talk, your mic stays open and records every noise from you and the room around you, and too much noise makes communication nearly impossible. Push to Talk, as the name implies, will only allow your mic to listen when you hold down a certain key. To set up Push to Talk on Windows, go to Tools, Options, and then Capture. Select Push to Talk and choose which key you want to use. Try using something that you normally don't use when playing Minecraft. Our counselors prefer to use X or Control. Then click Apply and OK. Doing this on a Mac is a little bit different. Move your mouse to the top left corner of your screen where it says TeamSpeak 3. Click on TeamSpeak 3, Preferences, and then Capture. From there, go ahead and follow the same process as before. Don't forget, you can always ask a counselor for help if you're having trouble with Push to Talk. Now that everyone has Push to Talk set up, TeamSpeak will be a lot calmer and everyone will be able to hear each other. Your microphone is now disabled by default, and will only transmit your voice when you hold down your push to talk button. You will also see the blue circle next to your name light up while holding down your button. If it seems like no one can hear you, make sure you're pressing the right button, and check to see if your blue circle is lighting up. To make sure we all get a chance to speak, we have a few TeamSpeak guidelines. Use headphones to avoid causing an echo. Always be respectful of other speakers. Be polite and try not to interrupt others while they're talking. Avoid shouting or singing into your mic. If a counselor is speaking or holding a lesson, be sure to give them your full attention. And remember, community guidelines apply to TeamSpeak chat too. If you want to say something or ask a question while someone is talking, raise your hand in chat by typing a plus so everyone knows you'd like to speak. If someone else raises their hand, give them a chance to talk as well. Thanks for watching! 
If you haven't watched our onboarding video yet, click here. Or check out our other videos here. See you soon!